Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing um, a Primark haul with a few little extra bits that I've just bought in here and there, but the majority of it is from Primark, so I thought I'd just call it a Primark haul because everyone loves a good old Primark haul. Yes, I do have quite a bit of stuff, so I'm just going to jump straight into the video. So here is my Mahoosive Primark bag. So the first thing that I picked up were these. Um, I actually got the last ones there, they had these and they also had some coloured ones but I just preferred the clear ones with like the coloured edges um, and I bought this because I don't really have like toiletry bags as such and um, I don't know if some of you may know but I'm actually going to New York in April um, around Easter time, is it Easter in April? Um, yeah I just thought like the little one would be good for um, my carry-on kind of liquids that I need to put in a clear bag and then obviously makeup and bigger toiletries and stuff so I just got that and that was £4. Then I picked up this glasses case, um, this was £1.50 and I don't know if you'll be able to see but it's just black kind of crock print and I did actually get some new glasses. These aren't from um, Primark, these are actually from H&M and they look like this on they're kind of like a Wayfarer cat eye style with um, this gold bar so yeah I thought they were really really nice and they were 7 99 Then I picked up a pair of these flip flops um, they have a lot of their summer shoes in now pretty much all of them I'm guessing and I went over to the flip flops and I was actually trying on other pairs of shoes and I just saw these and these are a pound and they're just their black flip flops and I go through so many pairs of flip flops in summer because that's literally all I wear in summer so I just thought I'd get some now whilst they are still in store because I know that these flip flops sell out so quickly as they're a pound and they're just obviously plain. Then just got some underwear which is a little bit weird to show but it just looks like this um, and it's kind of like uh, a purple with like nude pinky colour and this was just like £4 for the bra and then um, the matching knickers as well which I thought was so so good and then um, I also picked up these which is just like a pack of thongs I hate that word thong it's just so grim but it's got like this pattern which is kind of like tropical and then um, a nude and a navy and those ones were £2.50 and the set was £4 then picked up this necklace and I just absolutely adore this necklace I saw it on the stand and it was just so different to everything that they had I just absolutely love this turquoise colour it's so nice for summer and um, I just thought this necklace was really really nice and kind of statement like and obviously I wear a lot of black and white and grey so anything with a little bit of colour that can kind of inject a bit of pop of colour into my outfit then I'm all for it but I love this necklace and it was only £4. Then I picked up two um, pairs of shoes. Um, now these are the same colour but they're both a different style but I just thought they'd be so perfect for summer. So I picked these both up in a size 4, bearing in mind I'm actually a size 5 so um, I would suggest probably going a size down for these. But I picked up these little sandal kind of shoes with this tiny little heel. Um, and I know Topshop brought out these last summer um, in a black colour and a white colour I think um, but I saw these in Primark and I just thought they'd be so nice for just um, everyday kind of wear and also I'm going to Ibiza in summer um, with a bunch of girls and I thought it'd be really good for there um, and these were just £12 so I thought that was so good um, and just looks really nice with any kind of plain outfit because it's a really versatile colour. The next pair of shoes are these and obviously they are exactly the same colour which was really really odd. Um, uh, they were in completely different places, different floors, um, but I just obviously was attracted to this colour on that day. But uh, These are also in a four and I absolutely love these. I have a black pair just like this from New Look, um, but yeah, it's just got a band at the front and a band at the top of your foot and then the buckle. And I just thought these were so nice. They looked really nice with the outfit that I actually had on, maybe going for like um, a meal in summertime. Um, they'd look really nice and obviously going out and stuff in Ibiza it would be really really good um, and these were £14 so £2 more than the other ones. The next thing that I got is this and I have been looking for a tumbler um, for so long literally like I just can't find like a reasonably priced one that's plain anywhere and I went into Primark and there was only three of these left and these girls were like eyeing them up so I eyeing them up so 
So I grabbed this one quickly and I absolutely love it. Like it's such a gorgeous colour and it matches my room. Obviously you have to have stuff that matches your room. Especially when it's going to sit on your desk and stuff. All pretty but um, I got this one. It's like a mint green colour with obviously the mint green rubber band. And this was £2.50. Like, and I just feel like um, it's a really good idea to get one of these if, especially if you don't drink a lot of water because this cup is just so like, cool. Mm. Is that the word to use for a cup? I don't know. Like I want to drink out of it so it makes me drink a lot more water and stuff which, which is very important obviously in summer when you're going to get dehydrated so yes I absolutely love this and they had loads of different other patterns as well so if you don't like this one definitely go and check out Primark because they do have more of these. Moving on to some other things that I bought that weren't from Primark, um, I went into H&M and I bought this little pom pom, I thought this was so cute, um, just like a little fur pom pom that you can click on, click, clip onto um, a handbag or like um, a keychain, something like that, so I just got that one and that one was 2 dollars from Zara, um, I went into the sale and picked up a few more bits. I literally just can't help myself, but I just got this nude long sleeve top that has kind of these almost patches on the sleeves, but yeah, it's really plain, but looks really, really nice. And that one was 5 dollars From online um, Zara, I ordered these trousers and I don't know if you'll be able to see, but they're kind of cinched like high-waisted um, and they just go straight down. They're like a straight leg trouser um, with like a slit at the bottom. and I thought these were going to come a little bit above my ankle but because I'm so short they don't um, so they kind of just cut at my ankle which is a little bit long but I thought these would look really really nice especially for my 18th um, wearing them with some heels that I've actually got to show you um, I think these will look really really nice um, they're a really really nicely made trouser and they were reduced to 7 99 so I just couldn't not get them if you follow me on Instagram you'll see that recently um, I was kindly sent some shoes from Soul Affair um, Soul Affair are a website that sell loads of different types of shoes, they sell boots, knee high boots, ankle boots, um, like party heels, um, just literally every kind of shoe you'd want, a sandal, just anything and I'm going to link their website below because their shoe variety that they have is so on point and it's so like up to date shoes are really really affordable both these pairs of shoes that i'm going to show you are under 30 pounds each and i just thought that was really good for the quality that you get um so yes yeah, so the first pair of shoes that i got were boots um these come in a black color but i got this color because they're a little bit different and i'm so like obsessed with black i just buy too much black so yes i got these and these are actually burgundy and they've got like red bits like randomly it looks like kind of a polished effect and they've got a zip at the front you've probably seen these quite a lot because quite a few bloggers have them and these are actually by truffle um and i have another pair of shoes um some pointed shoes which i saw on i dress myself pretty sickly channel she literally has the perfect style and i am obsessed with her so i bought those shoes um from truffle and they are such good quality and when i saw that these were actually truffle like that's just amazing the quality of these are so so good and these were $24.95 I think something like that um, so I absolutely love those the second pair of shoes that I got were these and oh my gosh these are so beautiful um, they look like this and they're those classic kind of heeled sandals they've got two straps at the front one is faux suede and one is just faux leather and then obviously two straps here as you can see it's kind of like a cut out detail I don't know if you're able to see but there's the cut out they're suede and then the rest is faux leather and these were 19 95 I think on their website and they're just such good quality again these are by the brand Red Kiss and I absolutely love these I tried them on and they just look phenomenal and I think I'm going to wear these on my 18th but thank you so much Soul Affair for sending me these shoes I absolutely adore them and I'd all recommend you to go over to their website and check out their shoes because honestly they are so so nice and so reasonable for the quality that you get I'll link their website down below so the last few bits I got were from Superdrug and really there isn't much in here so I'm just going to dive straight in. Um, we actually picked up this one, whoa, <laughs> what is it with me and hitting myself in the face and products? Oh, poor eyebrow. This is a new shampoo conditioner kind of line from Herbal Essences and it's the Nourish Me Butter um, with Kapuachu Butter, oh I don't know. I have no idea, but you need to smell this. Oh my god. 
smells of like cocoa butter mix of almond butter it's just incredible you need to go and try this so i'm going to try the shampoo because i we didn't buy the conditioner because we never really use conditioner so yeah but this one was like one pound something in super drug this is a bit of a random one to show but i got the colgate max white one optic toothpaste i've heard a lot of good things about this um that it's good for whitening your teeth so i thought i'd try it but that wasn't the reason why i bought it it was 4.49 but if you bought this then you got a free tanya burn nail polish with it so my mum told me about this and she was like let's go into super drug so went in and we got a tanya burn nail polish free with this and i got the shade peaches and cream because I'm so into like these nude peachy colours at the moment on my nails. I absolutely love them. So yes, we got those two and that was $4.49 for both of them. And then the last thing that I got, I've seen on the Persian Babe, um, Barbara's channel and Sabrina. And they both did a review on this foundation and I just thought it looked beautiful on their skin. The concept of this foundation is just everything I would love in a foundation. It's meant to be really lightweight, really pigmented. Um, and just not f like you can't feel it on your skin which I love the coverage of Estee Lauder Double Wear but oh my god it is so thick and you can just feel it on your skin which really it doesn't bother me but I can see how it bothers some people so Maybelline have just brought out this new foundation called the Dream Flawless Nude Foundation and I got mine in the shade 30 Sand Sable um, me my mum and my auntie all got one of these because it was actually three for two so it turned out to be like four pound a bottle or something um you actually only get 20 mil in here and you usually get 30 mil in a drugstore foundation but you really don't need a lot of this so i can kind of see why they've done that and i love the small bottle i'm definitely taking this to new york with me because that would just be so good like even if you want to take this on the plane just to kind of touch up before you get off the plane um i think that'd be such a good idea and i haven't tried this yet on myself but i um, my mum has gone out tonight and I put this on her and it looked incredible like she doesn't usually wear foundation she usually wears BB cream but I use like three drops I think on her whole face and it was just like perfect her skin looks so nice and it changes like into a powder really quickly so if you have um, oily skin I think this foundation would be really really good for you um, sometimes when you see you can kind of see the powder separate from the liquid like it's really really weird and you, you have to shake well obviously before you use it but at the moment these are 5 dollars in super drug and on three for two so you definitely get your hands on these um, but yes I'm so excited to try this and I think I might do a first impressions on this because it looks amazing so that is all that I've got recently from Primark and a few other stores um, I really hope you enjoyed this video and enjoyed what I have got. If you have any questions about any of the things that I've got, then definitely comment down below and I'll answer them or send me a message on Tumblr, anything that's easiest for you, email me, whatever. I uh, really, really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.